In today's video I'm going to show you how to install NetBeans 17. Go to Google, type in NetBeans download, select Apache NetBean releases, select download, then select your operating system Windows, then select the suggested download link at the top. Once downloaded, click on the executable downloaded file, select next, agree to the license agreement, select next again, and then select next, installing it to the default directory. If your Java 20 is installed correctly using Java Home, the IDEA will discover where it's installed. If not, watch my video on how to install Java 20, or browse to where you installed Java. Select next, allow to check for any updates, and then select install. Once finished, click on finish. Now you will find on the desktop an Apache NetBeans shortcut. Right click on the shortcut. For Windows 11, you'll have to click on show more options. And then left click on pin to taskbar. This will make the icon appear at the bottom on the taskbar, which will make it easier for launching in future. Then click on this shortcut on the taskbar. Once loaded, start a new project. Go to File, New Project. Now the three types of projects you can start. Maven, Gradle and Ant. We're going to create an Ant project. The reason why, it's the most flexible. Click on Java with Ant, then Java Application, then hit Next. Now you get to name your project. We're going to call our project Hello World. Then click finish. Where it says to do code application logic here, hit the enter key to go to the next line. Now type in capital S, finishing the word with system, then press dot, then type out because we're printing out to the console, then another dot, then type print, ln, ln meaning it's going to print to the next line after printing out a hello world. Then open brackets, and then double quotes and then in the double quotes you're going to type hello world at the end make sure you've got a semicolon the semicolon at the end terminates the line of code now you want to test the application go up to the play button and run the project you should see hello world printed down here in the console watch my next video how to install and set up java fx 20 and how to configure NetBeans so you can develop your own JavaFX projects.